ನಾನು ಬರ್ಕೊಂಡ್ತೀನಿ ನೀನು ಎಕ್ಸ್ಪ್ಲೇನ್ ಮಾಡ್ಕೊಂಡು ಹೋಗ್ಬಿಡು ಓಕೆ ನನ್ನ ಸ್ಕ್ರೀನ್ ಕಾಣ್ತಾ ಇದೆಯಲ್ಲ ಕಾಣ್ತಾ ಇದೆ ಸೊ ಇದು ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ನಂದು ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಇರೋದು ವಿತ್ ಔಟ್ಪುಟ್ ಇದೆ ಇಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟ್ ಯಾಕ್ ಆರ್ ಸಿ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಅವ್ರು ಎರಡು ಕೇಳಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಯಾಕ್ ಆರ್ ಸಿ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಟು ಕನ್ಸ್ಟ್ರಕ್ಟ್ ಪ್ರಿಡಿಕ್ಟಿವ್ ಆರ್ ಎಲ್ ಎಲ್ ಒನ್ ಪಾರ್ಸಿಂಗ್ ಟೇಬಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಗ್ರಾಮರ್ ಎ ಟೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಎ ಬಿ ಎ ಬಿ ಟೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಬಿ ಆರ್ ಎಫ್ಸಿಲಾನ್ ಯೂಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಟೇಬಲ್ ಟು ಪಾರ್ ದ ಸೆಂಟೆನ್ಸ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಸ್ಟ್ರಿಂಗ್ ಎ ಬಿ ಬಿ ಎ ಡಾಲರ್ ಓಕೆ ಸೊ ಗ್ರಾಮರ್ ರೂಲ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ಎನಿ ಹಾಫ್ ಇದು ಕೊಟ್ಟಿದಾರಲ್ಲ ಎ ಟೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಎ ಬಿ ಎ ಬಿ ಟೆಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಬಿ ಆರ್ ಅಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಥಿಂಗ್ ಬಟ್ ಎಫ್ಸಿಲಾನ್ ಸೊ ಅಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದ ಸಿಂಬಲ್ ಇನ್ಸ್ಟೆಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಎಫ್ಸಿಲಾನ್ ವಿ ಯೂಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅಟ್ ಇಮ್ ಅಟ್ ಸಿಂಬಲ್ ಓವರ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ಸೊ ವೆರ್ ಎವರ್ ಯು ಸಿ ಅಟ್ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಅನ್ ಎಫ್ಸಿಲಾನ್ he has told that he, he we can write it in uh, any of the case that is uh, within the c program or with respect to uh, i can write it in uh, the other program also uh, so yeah third program so here we are going with the c program instead of yak program um, so we know the preprocessor directives standard io standard library and string and here Uh, we have a uh, production a production is nothing but here i'm telling that i have a uh, two dimension array which is of uh, three rows and 10 columns in other words each and every character here each and every character <coughs> here uh, i have this is the first row this is the second row and this is the third row and 10 characters is nothing but as it is in the um, a uh, way of uh, two dimension so this will be in location 0 1 2 3 4 5 but here we are limiting it to 5 i think matter limit martidi why because uh, we we can also have production which is yielding to 10 characters also so this is be the production i have three production so production of 0 uh, is this production of 1 is this and production of 2 is this basically a tend to a b a b tend to b b b tend to Uh, alpha this will be the case and we also need to find the first and follow so this will also be some values so here first of this value we already know what exactly are those so a is having first as a so we have a and b is having first of b which we have b and b is also having epsilon epsilon are at symbol here so first is already ready so follow is in nothing but uh follow of a is what we don't have any of the capital a on the right hand side so we don't have follow of a so follow of b is follow of b is small a what about here follow of b again is for first of b first of uh, b is nothing but b only uh sorry uh, b uh, so yeah follow of uh, b is um, b and b is having uh the follow of b alla lochan ile so idon sölpa problem idella ad gotilla first and follow concept gotide next hog bidabi ad calculate ah next we have to create a table uh, table is having 3 4 and 10 um okay we are using input of 10 so input of 10 in the sense what will be the string string is this my input to the program will be uh, a b b a which will be seeing okay everything will be taken care from the main program will come to the main program uh, the output first we'll look into the output what exactly we have so grammar uh, if i give uh, this as a b a or b b or at symbol first it will print follow also it will print but it should tell me that whether the string can be satisfied or not that is actually the main case a b b a or whatever the string which i give here uh that string has to be satisfied so here you can see a b b a is what the input which we are giving for that input it has to satisfy so as we know uh first and follow we already know how to calculate uh stack input action this is what we need to display so we'll come back here where, uh, with the main program so main program is over here so we we declare few things the first thing is 
copy down the table one comma i comma j to empty that means this complete table what you see this complete table what you see will be uh, made as zero uh, or empty for the first case so art mele so empty art mele what i need to do once it is empty then we have to start with what exactly i'm printing first i'm printing the grammar first you can see that you can see a grammar this capital letter words is actually seen here so first a grammar print art mele a grammar it will print as a uh, string then it is printing three values 0 1 2 from the production of i as you can see from production of i what do i have sorry from production of from production of i that is three these three values it is displaying a b a b b and a that's what this sentence actually speaks about with sentence in the main program we have this production of i so as you can see the grammar production of 0 is a tending to aba, 1 is b tending to bb, and 2 is b tending to epsilon. Next, really, so it is uh, also printing first of, uh, what do I have the first? What do I have the first of uh, a, b, and again another uh, b? So first print martha there, follow also it is printing. As accordingly, what we have dis, uh, displayed in this particular string here. First lane akidim, follow lane akidim, the same thing will be displayed. So display maadi dad mele, then our thing starts. So, uh, main program alayde. So first and follow has been uh, pushed now. And after that, we are displaying predictive parsing table. Uh, th this is nothing but the straight uh, string which will be shown, as you can see over here, predictive parsing table for the given grammar. Next is, String copy of table of 0, 0 with empty, string copy of 0, 1 with A, string copy of 0, 2 with B, string copy of 0, 3 with dollar, string copy of 1, 0 with A, string um, and, uh, copy of table of 2, 0 with B. So, here now what we did, table of 0, comma uh, or, or I with J, 0, uh, sorry, uh, table with I, comma J, L, now we empty empty. Right, so table of 0, 0, 2, uh, table of uh, 2, mathe 3, everything will be empty that you have to observe. So 0 to that particular case, we are inserting some values. So how will that be shown? So initially you can see that uh, whenever it is, hmm, okay, so uh, table of 0, 0 is now made as empty, 0, 1 is A, 0, 2 is B, table of 0, 3 is dollar, uh, 1, 0 is A, table of 2, 0 is B. Uh, what I'll do is, I'll just show you how exactly it looks. So, uh, uh, uh. Okay, let's assume we are creating one table. So, so this is one table. This is one. Okay, so this is table of zero, one, and two. So this is the table name. So this is table. So this is table of zero. Sorry, this is zero and zero. So this will be one, this will be two, this will be one, two, three. So this is what the, actually the case is. So table zero, zero, now we initialize my way. So table of zero, zero is empty. That means, sorry, here there is nothing. This is empty. Table of one is uh, A and what about this is two. Next table of uh, 0, 3 is dollar. So what it says is 0, 3. That means I have another box here or another table. So table of 3 only, I have epsilon. So I have oh, sorry, dollar. <coughs> so I have dollar. So next, so table of 1, 0 is A. 
so table of one zero is a and table of uh, zero sorry two zero is b so this is b so e table we have now finished so next uh, e table we need to now fit, work it out so for i equal to zero i less than three i plus plus so first of i comma zero if it is not equal to at if it is not equal to at so as you can see here he firstly uh, first of the uh, this is three comma hundred so really what we have we have a so that's not actually an epsilon so if first of uh, zero comma zero not equal to at symbol that means if i don't have any productions if that is the case then i go for table of number of production i comma zero and number of first of i comma zero production of i else table of number of production of i comma zero and this comma production of i so yen agate andre i'll take the value of from the table of uh, zero comma zero then i'll place it in into the table ill in the illige i'll i'll actually put it into the production else this condition will be utilized so next case is uh, okay my particular table has been created that's what i have uh, stated here then you one line print martho uh, one line print martho that's what this one line refers to then uh, it it needs to look into which are the um, uh, which will be the table table of 0 comma 0 initially any day uh, initially it was nothing so next uh, table of um, 0 and 1 0 and 1 so 0 0 only we didn't have anything so 0 1 only what do we have we have a so that will be inserted so what it means is so how many grammars uh, or how many this thing we have uh, the strings so here which are the strings which we have we have a and b that you can see right so one is a and the other one is b here a particular uh, non terminal see there so one is capital a and the other one is sorry one is small a and the another one is small b so yeah once a but the b as you know illi 0 comma 0 i don't have anything 0 comma 1 ali i have a 0 comma 2 ali i have b so amur na display manji the next table ali what we need to work it out that we have to see so illi dan ka aitu then it started printing one line next enter the string terminated with dollar to parse so illi we are giving what input we have to work on so input is um, okay um, input a little one second so enter the spring sorry with dollar to parse so a b b a is what the i'm ex expecting it so i'm accepting it sorry so i have the in percentage yes that is in input e input only what do i have a b b a so input of zero initially uh, zero will be my value so is input not equal to null character that means kali area so first thing was i have my 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 input is not empty so the first thing inside uh, uh, in my zeroth location is actually a so it is not empty so take uh, that input if my input of i is not equal to zero andre not equal to a or not equal to b or not equal to dollar andre then you show it as a invalid string illa andre you go to the next one that's what exactly it is showing so illi for my first case input of zero is actually a right so actually a so this condition is actually false will false andaga this block will not be executed straight away it comes here so if i'm also checking if input of 0 minus 1 that is minus 1 not equal to dollar this is also a false that means here this condition actually says that you have not entered any input string which has a dollar and the so what it says is someone has inputted something and now so what it does is it pushes dollar into a stack initially it we have inbuilt uh, stack will be taken here so that stack uh, by default it will be pushed by dollar 
ಆಮೇಲೆ ಆಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಎಂ ಟಿ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಪುಷ್ ಎ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಪುಷ್ ಎ ವೈ ಎ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಮೈ ಎ ಇಸ್ ಹಿಯರ್ ದ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ಟಿಂಗ್ ಪ್ರೊಡಕ್ಷನ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವೈ ವಿ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಪುಷ್ ದ ಎ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಇಟ್ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿಕಮ್ ಎ ಡಾಲರ್ ಆ ಎ ಡಾಲರ್ ಇಂದ ವಿ ವಿಲ್ ಬಿ ಮೂವಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಟು ವಿಚ್ ಅವರ್ ವಿ ರಿಕ್ವೈರ್ ಸೊ ಪುಷ್ ಆಫ್ ಡಾಲರ್ ಸೊ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕ್ವೆಶನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಯು ಗೆಟ್ ಇಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಟ್ ಪುಷ್ ಫಂಕ್ಷನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಡೂಯಿಂಗ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಪುಷ್ ಫಂಕ್ಷನ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಆಕ್ಚುಲಿ ಟೇಕಿಂಗ್ ದಟ್ ಎ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂ ಎ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂನ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಪುಷಿಂಗ್ ಇಟ್ ಟು ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ ಆಫ್ ಟಾಪ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಪ್ಲಸ್ ಬೇಸಿಕ್ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ ಆಪರೇಷನ್ ಸೊ ದ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಒನ್ಸ್ ವಿ ಇನ್ಸರ್ಟ್ ದ ಪುಷ್ ಆಪ್ಷನ್ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ದಟ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ ಐ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಪುಷ್ಟ್ ಮೈ ಕೇಸ್ ಎ ದೆನ್ ಅಗೇನ್ ಐ ಕಮ್ ಬ್ಯಾಕ್ ಟು ದ ಮೈನ್ ಪ್ರೋಗ್ರಾಮ್ ವೆರ್ ಇಡ್ ಐ ಗೋ ನಾವ್ ಯಾ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಪುಷ್ಟ್ ಡಾಲರ್ ಇನಿಷಿಯಲಿ ದೆನ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಪುಷ್ಟ್ ಎ ಸೊ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದ ಕೇಸ್ ನಾವ್ ಇಫ್ ಐ ಟೇಕ್ ದಿಸ್ ಆಸ್ ಅ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ ಇನಿಷಿಯಲಿ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಪುಷ್ಟ್ ಡಾಲರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದ ಸೆಕ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಕೇಸ್ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಇನ್ಸರ್ಟೆಡ್ ಎ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಿಸ್ ಎ ನಾವ್ ಐ ನೀಡ್ ಟು ಮೂವ್ ಆನ್ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಸೊ ನಾವ್ ಐ ಇಸ್ ಮೇಡ್ ಆಸ್ ಜೀರೋ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಜೀರೋ ಲೊಕೇಶನ್ ಸೊ ಯಾ ಬೇಸಿಕಲಿ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಟು ಪ್ರಿಂಟ್ ಫ್ಯೂ ವ್ಯಾಲ್ಯೂಸ್ ಸೊ ದಟ್ ಟು ಲುಕ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಪ್ರೋಪರ್ ವೇ ಸೊ ವಾಟ್ ಇಸ್ ದಟ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಪ್ರಿಂಟಿಂಗ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ಪ್ರಿಂಟಿಂಗ್ ದ ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಕ್ ಇನ್ಪುಟ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಆಕ್ಷನ್ so this is what is stack input and action to uh, get it in the formatted output so next is some line which we are pushing so while input of zero i am again making my uh, value of i as zero so here i will be zero so while input of zero not equal to dollar of course it is not equal to dollar why it is now i is now equal to a and stack of top is also not dollar why because my stack of my stack of top is actually in a got it so here uh <clears throat> stack of top top is actually in one and uh, the value is basically not uh true here so input of zero not equal to dollar true stack of top not equal to dollar so both are successive state so i go to display function so coming to the display function what it will do it will print whatever on on the stack which we have it will display so int of i int is equal to top that means top is equal to one Uh, is one greater than equal to zero of course so i i display this character i so what do i have with character a sorry what do i have with the character uh, uh, in in my stack i have a got it so next thing is once it is done i am in a loop so i uh, go to zero again because i am decrementing the value of i so i will be negative uh, sorry uh, uh, top was one so one minus zero is now zero so i is zero less greater than equal to zero of course it's a true condition so what do i have in the stack of zero in the stack of zero i have dollar so a and dollar both will be displayed so a and dollar both will be displayed for the first case then after displaying that again i come back i come back come back uh yeah so once i come back here as this condition both is true i displayed then i come back so this is for the formatted uh, output why because <clears throat> as you can see here i need specific amount of space for uh, how exactly uh, i can differentiate right so everything is at one place everything is at one place everything is at one place so for the formatted output we have used uh, a slash t slash t that means uh, two particular places and we have used it so input plus one so input was um uh, input was uh, zero so uh, because uh, uh, input of Uh, i right so what was the input now i think it has incremented so if stack of top top was 1 one, one stack of 1 was what a right so is equals to input of i so input of i now um, i value was 0 of course now what do i have i have 0 input of 0 is what input of 0 is small a actually so small a what do i have a b b a so that is what we need to display now uh so i have uh, uh incremented with respect to the input and if stack of top is equals to input of i then i say that uh then i say that i have matched and that's where i come out that's where i come out but here stack of top is what stack of top is a and what is the input input is not a input is a b b a as you might see right so a b b a the next case is as this condition is not true because both are not equal both a and small a are not equal so what we do is we 
increment the value of, uh, I mean, it, it straight away it will not execute this case itself, right? So I come here. So stack of top is what? Capital A is greater than or equal to 65. Here comes the uh, this thing. So what is uh, 60, 65 in ASCII? 65 in ASCII is actually capital A. And uh, in decimal it is A, sorry, 41 in, as, uh, in hexadecimal and uh, 65 in uh, decimal that gives that it is a some character. So here, uh, 65 to 92, it's actually 26 to be specific. So we have capital values, that's what it say. My top is greater than 65 and it should be lesser than 92. That means 65 to 91 uh, are actually the capital case of ASCII, um, uh, uh, decimal ASCII code equivalent. Right. So next case is that means capital A in the capital Z tanka. I want every case of my stack to be pushed with that. OK, so next is string copy of uh, one variable which is have a current pointer. I think we have used somewhere with current pointer. So that is with curve and uh, curve of table of number of stack of top. So all this story here stack of top was what was top previously top was um, one so stack of top is actually a and i'm converting it number of a is some value and similarly number of uh, input of i i probably it was zero so input of zero is a so a to a so what do i have with the value so here you should uh, think that I, uh, whether the case is normal or not, right? So, illy, I'll copy the value, but when I compare with uh, the current pointer with respect to A, with, the, with respect to E, that means I don't have a valid value here, right? So, this string compare of current pointer with E, that's actually not true. So, it comes because this case itself is, uh, if it is uh, not working, then this will not work. That means if I give a small case here, it will not work. If I give a capital case, then it comes to stack pointer. And with the stack pointer, I'm looking for the value E. Um, so that gives me an invalid string. That means if I'm having some other case uh, of value which is not present. So that is that is the next value. So if in case I have uh, the value apart from this, right? So if top value is uh, uh, greater than 65, and it is somewhere if this case is not satisfied, if this case is not satisfied, so it straight away apply the production with the epsilon. So it prints with the epsilon star. So here, uh, as you, you know that, uh, we have A, B, P, A as a string. So what can this A be replaced with in order to get A, B, A? With the with the production, uh, what was what was the production? Uh, a tending to A B A. So A tending to A B A. A tending to A B A, and the other one was uh, B tending to B B. So B tending to B. B tending to epsilon, uh, B tending to small b capital B, small b capital B, and this again B is tending to an epsilon, or at which we can see. So this A, I want A A as the first thing, which is the production which first suited. I have to check A here. I also need to check in the production what I have. That is what this stuff is doing. This program, this uh, this particular program is doing here. It is checking with my case what I have in the number table. And is that the name? Is that the same thing which I have? Right? If that is the case, it will work on it. So if not, if I find that particular application, because I have a A here and I also have a production, right? If I have a production, then I'll apply the production. If not, then here only it will be rejected because invalid string and it is it, it cannot be applied. Here only it will be rejected. As now, 
I, I, I can apply the particular production. So whatever the case which we have, I'll, I'll use it. So here, mm, if my pop method, if my current one, if it case, if it is a pop one, then it will, uh, I mean, if the current pointer is at symbol, that means if it is an epsilon, I don't want to do anything. If not, then what I need, that means I have a production of A in my, uh, I have a production of A. In other words, that A non-terminal is actually in the top of the stack. So do I have a production which is actually present on the alphabet, which is on top of the production? This is what exactly it says. So yes, if it is that case, pop what do I have in top of the stack? I'm popping whatever I have in the stack and whatever I have in the N, A, B, A, push it into the stack. Push it into the stack. That's what this particular pop is doing and this pushes doing. Similarly, this will happen completely. This will happen completely and it will again come to a display. What exactly it want to be printed. So every time this A will go and it will be replaced with A, B, A. So A, B, A, this A will go off and that, uh, uh, what do you call it? A, B, A will be present. So how do I represent this? So this A will be gone. So if this A is gone, what is the new string which I have? Um, I have uh, A and I have B and I have A. Remember from the last A, B, okay, that's the capital B, sorry. So that's the capital B and again A. Now top will be where? Top will be here. So this is the location 0, location 1, location 2 and location so top where where is my top pointing now the point will be the top will be pointing to this case so the next what happens is now i need to look into what i have in the top and i have to check it with what i have in the input what i have in the top and what i have in the input so come here come back here because it it's actually running in a, uh, many uh, loops here right so uh, okay stack of top is equals to input of i so what do, here is where previously it was not matching so stack of top what do i have a and what is the input of uh, zero input of zero is what a if that is the case print matched and whatever the input which you have that's what exactly it is showing here that's what exactly it is showing here so aba as i said aba has been inserted then this is basically the string and it is it is showing you matched of A. Matched of A Agat Takshna. Once it is matched, then I have to pop that content which I have. So what happens here? A will be gone. So A will be gone. And what will be my uh, new string? Uh, or in other words, top will be uh, decremented. So here is my top. So what happened next? I check. I'm actually checking again. So what is with top with the at uh, with the item? Okay, so popping is happening. I is also happening. I increment Atashna, I will come here with respect to the input. Okay, so now what happened? My top of the stack is B and what is the input uh, character? Input character is B. So what happened? Here the condition is false now. Is this the case? No, then come here. Is it cap? Is it, is it, a, uh, uh, is it a capital character? Of course. It is a capital character. So if it is a capital character, what I need to do? Go look in the table. If it is in B, what do I have? If in, it is in B, that means in this B, uh, I have this production B of B. Actually, in this table, these values will be there. In, in this table, if you clearly work it out, these values will be there. So in that particular table, B has two production. One is B with B and B also have epsilon. So B with B and B. This case it will select because that will be initially written in the table. So this B, what it happens is it will be replaced by the next production. What is that next production which you see? Uh, cap small b and capital B. So here small b will be there and here capital B will be there. Okay. Uh, sorry. One second. So yeah, this should be the other way around. I'm very sorry. Uh, this will be the small b this will be the small b 
and this will be the capital B. So small b followed by the capital B. The next case is, <clears throat> yeah, by the time it will come to this loop and again it checks top with input, is it true? Of course, top and input both are true. If that is the case, what happens? My uh, cursor will be incremented and the top will be popped off. And once popped off, my top will be, the new top will be for this particular P. Now what happens? This B is now taken off. Got it. Now this B is pointing with this B. Okay, both are same? No. Okay, next question is, is this uh, uh, uppercase character? Of course, if it is uppercase character, go look into the table. What do I have with the B? If in that B, okay, I have a production, small B and capital B. Again, this B will be taken off. This P will be taken off and it will be replaced with what? This P will be re uh, replaced with small b and capital B. So this will be the capital B and on top this will be the small b and my new uh, top will be this particular place. Right? Now I am actually again looking into, okay, my top of the stack is small b and the next input is b. So what I do? Pop the contents of the stack. So once I pop the contents of the stack, my new uh, top will be actually pointing to this ca capital B and this will be incremented to A. Now comes the case. I have a B and I have a A. Got it? So if in that case, look carefully here. So I have an input. <coughs> uh, I look into this particular case. Uh, sorry, where did it go? Uh, 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 uh. Uh, yeah, so uh, while input not equal to dollar, of course, and top of stack is also not equal to dollar. If this case, yeah, both are not dollar. So next it will display in display in such a way that uh, that input will be displayed. Now it is looking for top is equals to input of I. Of course, both are not same. This is B capital B and this is small a. Both are not equal. Next, what will happen? Now uh, this case will not happen. It will jump to this case. So is it capital case? Of course, B is in capital. If in case B NRI something else you have given Andre, you have come towards an invalid string. That's why this case is there, right? So you come to the this case of B, and now uh, I have a B, I have a B, but I'm looking for A. So here it is not matching. That's what the case which will happen here. It is not matching. So once it is not matching, it also looks for is there a particular production which is epsilon? Of course, there is a production which is epsilon. Insert that particular place here with epsilon. That means this B will be just popped. It will not be inserted anything. So my top comes to here. So once I come here, so the next case is, uh, okay, A and A, is it matching? Of course it is matching. So uh, then, once you matched, that means this particular case of matched A will also be displayed. After that, you'll come back to, uh, again, once you match, this will also be popped off. So once you match, this case will also be popped off. And my top will be pointing to dollar. And I look for this case. If my both of the case are dollar, if my both of the case is dollar, this complete while will not execute. Straight away, it will come to this particular point top of uh, stack of top is not equal to dollar input of i and both are dollar as you can see whenever we are inserting we always put a dollar in the beginning right at the beginning of the string as you can see here and we have also inserted here can you see a b b a dollar so in the case now this case dollar and we also have a dollar if that is the case if that is the case this particular program will say it as invalid string at the end because I have already encountered our dollar with my input. Dollar input alle dollar band mele. If my top is not equal to dollar, then straight away we have to reject the string because the string has not been satisfied. All right, I guess you people have got it now. And uh, yeah, Luchan. That will be the end of this particular third program. Uh, one name should stop recording. Okay, okay, okay. yeah.